friends, it's me Raquel. I am kind of working in my garden today, but from my desk. And I wanted to show you how I'm going to prune my desert rose. So here we go. So here's my desert rose. And it got really cold here over the winter, so I brought it inside. All the leaves dropped off. Um, I don't see that really being an issue, but I need to prune it. It's springtime in a few weeks and so I'm gonna take care of my friend here and get it ready to start blooming some beautiful pink flowers as you can see I have some new growth here already but I'm gonna take it off so let's do it first I'm gonna take these down um, I don't think they're little sucklings, but this one is, well, you see that just popped right off, so we don't have to worry about that. And, uh, I'm gonna leave that alone. But this one I'm gonna cut, and I'm going to cut right above or on its, uh, little elbow here. In fact, I'm gonna cut above it. I think that's best. I watched a video on doing it, so, <laughs> we'll see. And this one, I kind of want to take it down. It's a little weak up in here. Oh, wow. So I'm just going to cut it right here and cut it on an angle. And cut this one here on an angle. And I'm kind of feeling out to see if it's where it gets a little soft at. So I feel a little softness here, so I'm going to cut this on an angle. And this is my last one. This is my best one, clearly. And I already see where it's probably been cut before, but this is where it's kind of loose. So I'm going to cut this one on the angle as well. And what I learned from watching the videos is that this plant has a little gooeyness that comes out that can be irritating. I rarely use gloves, which I should use, but it's so much easier. Ooh, that's my phone. It's so much easier without gloves. So I'm going to just dab this, dab the tops here, get some of that liquid off. And then I was told to use cinnamon. It's in a garlic bottle, but trust me, it is cinnamon. <laughs> I didn't realize that. Anyway, my mom, I was using her uh, some Thai cinnamon or something she had and she was like, oh no, you better find something else. So there was a different bottle of cinnamon and I put the rest in here. So <laughs> I'm just gonna sprinkle that and then tap it in. And this is to help the roots. I really hope that the lady on the video was right because I really would like to keep this plant. And a little bit here. And I have one more. And this usually helps, well this helps to keep infections off the plant, out of the plant system. So that's why you would use, I should have just done that, that's why you would use the uh, cinnamon. And that is it for this. And I'm just gonna clean this up right here. Clean that up. And this should really create some growth. And, you know, I think this may be a suckling, this one right here. So I'm gonna cut it anyway. I mean, I don't see where it could harm it. And give that some cinnamon as well. Oh wait, let me tap it first. I'm a little stingy with the cinnamon here <laughs> and that's gonna be all I'm gonna do with this and I'm looking forward to seeing this plant like really take off and do some awesome things hello friends it's me Raquel here is an update on the desert rose 
it's been repotted as you can tell in a cactus succulent citrus soil look at those buds you can see that it's just sprouting everywhere yay even this one it's coming along slowly I think it's sprouting if not I'm just gonna take it off but at any rate I'm very happy very happy so you see you guys just do it nothing to it but to do it <laughs> don't be afraid <laughs> just chop it give it a nice little haircut have a great day